all right guys uh this is marco flores and this is baby bull gabriel hernandez uh tell the fans uh baby bull what's your record and uh, where can they follow you at hey what's up guys i'm gabe the baby bull hernandez i'm currently 10 wins nine knockouts and one loss um i'm from san diego and you can follow me on um instagram at the baby bull is there anything you want to tell the fans before we begin uh Talking about Jake's Jake Paul's power? Nothing, bro. That I'm getting back to back to things. I had a bad promotional little promotional uh, little argument, kind of slash. Uh, you know, what I mean, little little things that happened in the sport of boxing. But now I'm getting back, getting ready to come back in the ring, and I'm excited to be back in the mix. Perfect. All right, let's get into the Jake Paul baby bull. Baby bull. How would you rate his power? Jake Paul hits hard, bro. He is like, yeah, I'd say a power wise, knockout power wise, is he can knock you out in a pro fight with ten ounce gloves. He, his knockout ratio is going to be like seventy to eighty percent, I think. And he like he hit he hits that hard. Like you, if he hits you in the shoulder, you feel it. Like yeah, it's it's power. It's like 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 uh. Quick, snappy power. It's not like like oh, a guy loads up and he hits you with a hard right hand that you saw coming. Uh-huh. It's like he can throw a one, two, three, and that third shot is kind of snappy and hard, and it, it, it'll get you. It'll wake you up, bro. And and have you seen the? Because he's been knocking down people in sparring in Vegas. Have you seen that? Yeah, bro. After after the uh, the dude from the Ace family, what's his name? Who um the one he sparred in um, Vegas. No, Catherine's Catherine's man, Catherine's husband. Um, what's his name? Oh, Austin. Austin. After Austin was talking all that smack, um, Jay posted a bunch of sparring knockout clips. Man, that was pretty cool. That was pretty tight. I'm glad I wasn't on one. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, well, how many how many rounds did you guys spar? With you, well, with, Jake, with Jake, I probably sparred. Oh, 15 rounds maybe 15 damn yeah and um how how would you rate his his dedication like so when i first got to sparring a lot i went to school spark so so mind me i i'm not i wasn't big into youtube i didn't really know who was who mm-hmm. like they look familiar oh that guy looks familiar but right. i thought he was mm-hmm. boxing familiar mm-hmm. so so they invited me to come over and spark uh logan so i'm gonna go spark logan i looked him up i'm like oh shit this is just famous and then while I was there, they're like, "Oh, bro, you can spar Logan's brother, he, uh, Jake. He's gonna he's gonna be a fighter too." And I'm like, "Okay, bet." And he was just he was young. He's younger than me. He's young. Um, he wasn't gonna fuck. He was hungover. He was he was just chilling. He was. And then he got in the ring with me. He was super cool. It was just a cool atmosphere. But I was in there with like not a real boxer. I was in there with with someone just hanging out. Mm. And then. This dude, the more I saw him, the more dedicated, the better in shape I was even. I'm like, oh, damn, this dude's really picking this up. And it came natural to him. Hmm. Babel, and talk about the... Because not, not a lot of fighters get introduced to the... What can I call it? The the Jake Paul... Uh, the Logan Paul... Like, the backyard, it's, it's a whole... like. I know it's a whole different atmosphere, right? Like going into the Jake Paul, Logan Paul. Yeah, it's like, cool, bro. You you pass through a dope ass mansion, like you pass through his now. Now I'm like after I met them, I'm like more into it, right? Mm-hmm. Like you, I saw fucking um, Logan Paul's podcast booth, like that was tight. Like you, I passed walked by, it was like, oh, what the hell? You see the you see his his uh, G wagon, you see his bus, like. It's stuff that, that at the moment I was like, oh, this dude's rich, has a bunch of toys, and now looking like, oh, this dude, this dude's pretty tight. Like, and that's pretty cool, right? Because I know when people spar Floyd, when people spar, let's say Gervonta Davis, now Logan Paul. I, obviously, it's, it's a different. Uh, like, you must get a, a little nervous. Like, it's a different. Yeah, pers- it's like, like even when I went to when I went to the Robert Garcia gym. Mm-hmm. That was eye opening. It was like, oh my god! And then after that, I went to Wild Card, and I was like, bro, like, fuck, Pacquiao trains in here, like it's a different atmosphere. And uh, with Logan Paul, it was more of a, more of a dude. This dude's mansion is super dope. This dude is this dude's pretty cool. Like, like they're genuine people. It's not like they're putting up a front. Like they were actually pretty good, welcoming, inviting. 
people, and it was just a cool atmosphere to be in. Hmm. What do you? What, what's your prediction for Saturday night? Uh, Jake Paul versus oh, Nate. Oh, he's gonna knock him out. He's gonna knock Nate out. You probably, what you think? The second round, first round, third. No, Nate's an athlete. Uh-huh. He might not even. He might not even get a. It might. I don't know. It might end the stool. Maybe. I don't. I don't. I don't know. Because he's athletic. He's mm-hmm. gonna be able to take more punishment. How How many rounds is the fight? It's uh six rounds. Six rounds. I see it in the fifth. In the late fifth, he might be hurt, get dropped, or something. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, there you go, guys. That's. Is there? Do you want to say anything more about his power? Jake, yeah, yeah, Jake is hard, bro. I'm excited. Um, I'm excited to hopefully he knocks he knocks that dude yeah. out and make it move on to bigger fights. One one out of ten. How hard does he hit? Like, uh, I'm gonna say eight. Hey, okay. There you go, guys. That was the the que- the question. The answer, eight. This is Marco Flores and Baby Bull signing out. Make sure you follow his Instagram. What was it again, Baby Bull? At the Baby Bull. Um, follow me on Instagram, guys. There you go, guys.